Okay, I may have done something terrible. I went away for the weekend with my girlfriend to celebrate our two year anniversary and as a consequence, I missed two days of uploading. I'm sorry, I'm just as upset as you are. Boo rival your trash. Yeah, we get it. However, nothing really noteworthy happened, so we didn't miss out on much. Anyway, I didn't make news story videos when this incident actually happened, but when I read about it, I knew I had to make one because I'd never heard of anything like this happening and it's actually crazy. This story comes from the middle of last year in June 2022 when a Korean streamer known as QRE was locked in a three hour bronze ranked game by stream snipers. She ended the game with 121 deaths. I've linked the entire VOD in the description if anyone wants to watch three hours of just plain cyberbullying. This all sounds quite confusing, so let me explain how it actually happened. QRE got two stream snipers on her team and two on the enemy. The two players on her own team would clear minions and tell the enemy where she was, essentially ghosting for them. This also means she could never FF because two votes would always say no. They held her in this match for three hours, some of which she even went and played FIFA on the side. But worst of all was that after the match had finally concluded, she was the one that got a 14 day ban when the stream snipers reported her, as her scoreline would look like she was inting from the outside in. To make matters even worse, she was against a center that had insanely long range, so if she got locked on the fountain, the center could just one shot her from the nexus. And if she somehow wasn't getting one shot from a center off the screen, they also had an Evelyn that, as we know, can just be perma stealthed and track her down. Apparently, in the Korean streaming culture, this kind of obsessive inting sniping is quite common among female streamers. What do you think of the situation? Was the ban justified? Let me know in the comments below and for more League news, click the video on your screen. Bye.